Good to see you again, Naturals fans. I'm the voice of the Naturals, Nicholas Batters, here in Surprise, Arizona at Surprise Stadium. We're continuing our series of interviews with Naturals players in the Arizona Fall League. Today, it's pitcher Nate Webb. Nate, how are you doing? How's the Fall League season treated you so far? Uh, I'm doing well. It's been uh, it's been fun so far. I mean, just kind of getting an opportunity to come back out here and show what I got. And Yeah, uh, yeah I mean, I've just been having a good time so yeah. far. What does it mean to be selected or named to the Fall League? Because this is really the best of the best of the minor mm-hmm. leagues. Um, I mean, you know, it, it means a lot. And yeah. just, like I said, just kind of getting the opportunity to sure. come out here and showcase what I have against, you know, a lot of other really good guys. Yeah. And, uh, yeah, it's it's been fun. It's been awesome. Yeah, how much does that help not only playing with some of the best, but you're playing against the best mm-hmm. too, right? I mean, that, that helps development across yeah. the board. Yeah, uh, definitely helps development, like you mm-hmm. said. Yeah. Um, confidence level goes up too when you when you throw well so uh yeah just those kind of combine just you know kind of make you feel good and uh make you feel like you're getting better really so and making some new friends along the way yeah. playing with players from other organizations that's pretty neat yeah. right yeah i mean all the guys we have in our locker room are awesome so yeah, yeah. i just enjoy coming to the field every day and uh getting to hang out with those guys so and few, I have to imagine, we talked about this during the season, but missing really the first mm-hmm. half of the, the minor league season, now you're getting the extra work and you get the innings mm-hmm. back up a little bit. How has this helped your development getting to, to continue after the minor league season ends? Um, I, I mean, coming out here, I, I didn't start the fall league right away, right. obviously, and so um, I think it was just kind of getting the innings in that I needed, um, getting the reps, you know, and just kind of coming out here and making sure that I fill up the zone has, has helped me a lot. So. Obviously, you would have loved to have stayed healthy this entire season, but looking at the minor league season, what were you able to take away from 2022? Um, I mean, mostly for me, it was just kind of attack the zone. Um, when I get away from that is, you know, get the walks uh, climbed, and that's something that I wasn't really accustomed to coming off the 2021 season. Uh, so it was kind of, uh, kind of a struggle just getting in the zone, but... Yeah. Uh, like I said, getting here, I, I've been attacking the zone like I need to, and it's yeah. helped a lot. So attacking the zone, just getting your innings in, was mm-hmm. there anything else that you came into the Fall League wanting to accomplish or, or work on? Um, really just mostly yeah. that. It was yeah. mostly kind of proving that I could stay in the zone like I, I have been in the past. Sure. Um, and, yeah, so far I've done that, and I've been happy with my production. So. Now, as we record this, the World Series is going on. So for you, I have to flash back to 2015. Obviously special for Royals mm-hmm. fans. You were involved. You were on the grounds crew. Mm-hmm. Uh, tell us that story a little bit. What are some of your favorite memories from the 2015 season? Um, yeah, so I got the job because my summer ball coach was the or is the head groundskeeper. Yeah. Um, and so I got a job through him. But, I, you know, I just there was a good group of guys there. I got to work with a lot of my friends that yeah. were that I played baseball with and uh, just kind of being a part of that World Series run was, I mean, it was awesome. You have Phillies and Astros prospects in the clubhouse, but none of them can say that they have a World Series ring like you do, right? Right, yeah. I mean, that was, yeah, I was, we, uh, in 2014, we had got the ALCS ring when we yeah. lost in the World Series, but, uh, yeah, we, I mean, none of us were really sure if that was going to happen for us, sure. and uh, we're just obviously happy that it did. It's really cool to have one of those. And you haven't stopped ring collecting either, being with Quad Cities no. last year. I mean, I mean, each is just as mm-hmm. special. I mean, maybe it's not a World Series ring, but yeah. but each is very special, right? Well, when you play for it, play for the team and win, it's a little bit. It means a lot more. Yeah. Um, but yeah, it's. I mean, that that Quad Cities team was really good, and hopefully, we can come out here in the fall league and get us a, get ourselves another one. I was going to say the surprise for us. I mean, you guys are the team to beat right mm-hmm. now in the in the in the fall league. What have you seen from the team as a whole? Because it, it looks like it's the most talented squad far and away. Yeah, uh, I mean, obviously we have a lot of talent, yeah. um, a lot of big name guys here, and uh, honestly, I, it just the team yeah. is always rooting for each other, yeah. uh, which is really cool to see, especially coming or like you know we don't know each other sure. or we didn't know about yeah. know anyone coming into it. So um, yeah, it's just awesome yeah. to see. A little over a week left in the fall league, so the baseball season wrapping up for you. What does the off season look like for Nate Webb? Do you have any fun plans? Anything that you're looking forward to before spring training kicks back up? Um, yeah, I've got some things planned. Uh, just really, it's just going to be kind of going up or, or about going home and yeah. hanging out with family, friends, my girlfriend, and yeah. all that. So yeah, it'll be it'll be a good time. Nate, really appreciate the time. Thanks so much. Good to catch up, and best of luck down yeah. this final stretch. Look forward to doing this Thank again you. soon. Thank you.